Yes. There are CDs over there. Oh, CD launch. Yes, yeah, CD launch. Well, the CD launch was last weekend. Uh, that was great fun. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, that's about as near to the hard sell as you're going to get tonight. <laughs> it's called a rose from my, uh, from my mother's garden. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to kick off with the title song. Uh, and the point of this song was really that when I wrapped up my parents' house, it was harder saying goodbye to my mother's garden than it was to the house itself. So, uh, I picked a rose from my mother's garden at the dusking of the day. And in that rose from my mother's garden, all the sweets of the summer lay. Oh, the smoke fall of many autumns, and the quickening of so many springs, scent of frost and of summer woodbine, and a thousand remembered things, and the chink there of summer teacups, and the music across the lawn, and the children's prittling, prattling voices, all heedless of any bitter thorn. Oh, where is the summer laughter? Oh, where are the winter snows? <coughs> Only echoes are in the garden and a single autumn rose. I walked away from my mother's garden for its I may no longer stay. I walked away from my mother's garden at the dusking of the day. I walked away from my mother's garden for the season was at a close. But I shall find her in every garden and in the fragrance of every rose. Lovely. So, yeah, um, one of the uh, people who kind of reviewed this CD said that it had a lot of songs of renewal on it, which I suppose it does. Um, <coughs> we sing a lot about the natural renewal of seed time and harvest in the folk scene, but this is, this is a song which I wrote uh, just after the Orlando massacre, and as it turns out, just before the, re the re um, Brexit referendum. But it, anyway, it seemed like a very dark time, and... Um, and I thought, well, there's been plenty of times that have been really dark and people have come through them and, mm -hmm. you know, just have to get on with it, I suppose. So, and it's partly inspired by the, uh, that song about the Mary Ann Carter. Because oh. Rise Again is mm -hmm. always a sentiment that you need yeah. in yeah. this world. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's right. Telling you who 
should be hating and just why you need that new device when the phantoms on the screen are all that can be seen just remember that they're playing you with loaded dice you got to look into your heart for your truth and turn and rise again look into your heart for your truth and turn and rise again when they're telling you the terms of the battle and what constitutes a valid Tell you how to look cool and how not to look a fool And just how to put your soul out to rent you got to look into your heart for your truth And turn and rise again Look into your heart for your truth And turn and rise again that our fears will divide us that the only thing that bonds us will be hate and they love to blow apart our great collective heart so come on now before it is too late you got to find the hearts that love what you love and turn and rise again Find the hearts that love what you love And turn and rise again Oh, well, ain't nobody said it would be easy And ain't nobody said it would be fun But in the darkest night you gotta find the tiny light Cause if you can't then the bastards have already won. So catch a shining moment on the run. You've got to find the hearts that love what you love and turn and rise again. Find the hearts that love what you love and turn and rise again. Find the hearts that love what you love And turn and rise again Thank you. Thank you. And yeah, that's sort of partly about to rising up and dealing, dealing with misuses of power, I suppose. And this song is uh, <coughs> about a similar thing, and it's a very different song. And it mentions the, um, the Heading Hill, which um, is a an actual place in Stirling. Some of the versions actually talk about the Hanging Hill, but it is actually the Heading Hill. You can still see the stone on the Heading Hill at Stirling with the marks of the axes where they beheaded people. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. There's a nice picture of it in the booklet of the CD. <laughs> <laughs> About the Yule when the winds blow cold and the round tables begin. Oh, there is come to our king's court Many's the well-favoured man The queens looked over the castle wall They held both dale and down And there she spied young waters Arriving to the town his footmen they did walk before and his horsemen rode behind a garment of the burnished gold 
did keep him from the wind. All golden grazed his horse before, and silver shod behind. The horse that waters rode upon was swifter than the wind. And then up spoke a wily lord, and unto the queen said he, Oh, say whose is the fairest face rides in the company? Oh, I've seen Lord, and I've seen Laird, and knights of high degree. But young Waters is the fairest face that ever mine eyes did see. And then up spoke the angry king, and a jealous man was he. Saying if he had been twice as fair, you might have accepted me. Oh, you neither lord nor laird, she says, but the king that wears the crown. And there's not a knight in all of Scotland, but to thee must bow down. But for all that she could do nor say, appeased he would not be. And for the words that the Queen had spoke, young Waters, he must die. And they have taken young Waters and put fetters on his feet. And they have taken young Waters and thrown him in dungeon deep. Oh, it's oft I've ridden through Stirling town, in the wind both and the wet. But I never rode through Stirling town with fetters on my feet. It's oft I've ridden through Stirling town, in the wind both and the rain. But I never rode through Stirling town, never to return again. And they have taken to the heading hill, his horse both and his saddle. And they have taken to the heading hill, his young son in his cradle. And they have taken to the heading hill, his lady fair to see. And for the words that the Queen had spoke, young Waters, he did die. <laughs> now, it mentions that I do storytelling. <laughs> now it's quite hard to find a story that is short enough to fit in a little 20 minute set but I managed to find one Yay. and it's one with a chorus oh. even better you'll soon pick it up it's about this rabbit anybody who wants to revert to nursery quick rabbit impression <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. We got a couple there. Yeah, come on, bit few more. Rabbit impression. That's it. So, a rabbit goes into a butcher's shop. Now, at least with you lot, I don't have to explain what a butcher. I mean, like you know, I, 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 I ask, I ask the kids in the primary school. I, I, I double check. I have to double check that I have to, I have to double check with them that Robin Hood is not a fox, <laughs> and I have to double check with them. Uh, you know what a butcher sells? Books is the usual answer. Oh. <laughs> anyway, Rabbit goes into a butcher's shop, which is probably not a good idea. With his, his ears all up and cheeky. And, and he's like this with his paws on the counter going... Got any cabbage? That's the chorus. We practice that. 
Yeah. That's it, that's it, you're getting it, you're getting it. It's only a CSE course, that one. And the butcher's like, cabbage. This is a butcher's, you stupid rabbit. Now get out, go on, get out. Oh, ears all down and drooping. Out it goes. Next day, back in, ears all up and cheeky, comes in. <laughs> you again! Look, I told you to get out. Look, 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 I, I, I sell meat, I sell eggs, you know, things like that. I do not sell cabbage and carrot and all that rabbit food. Get out! Ooh. Oh. 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 Very next day, back in again. Ears all up and cheeky. <laughs> you need to cabbage! There's a greengrocer's up that way, and there's Tesco's up that way. <laughs> now just get out of my shop. I don't want to see you in here again. I'm getting really fed up of this. Oh. Stupid rabbit. Oh. Oh. He's all down and droopy. Next day, <coughs> he comes again. <laughs> <laughs> You've got him, Harry! Now look here, says the butcher. I am sick up to here with you coming in here with your cabbage. And if you come in here once more with your cabbage, I'm going to nail your ears to the counter. <laughs> Next day. Here he comes. Here's a one cheeky. Got any nails? <laughs> <laughs> no, says the look, I'm sick to death of this. I, I, I sell meat. No, I don't sell nails. Go down B and Q or something. Oh, says the rabbit. No, I've got no nails then. No, I haven't. Oh, he said. And it seems that no performance that I do anywhere is complete without the hedgehog song oh, yeah. Yeah. these days. Um, it is my most requested song that I've ever written <laughs> and it causes me to be given hedgehog objects, <laughs> which is, uh, which is lovely, yes, and, um, and it has a joy in it bit, because uh, when I go, I just want to be a hedgehog, hedgehog, exactly, your bit <coughs> is to sort of chant hedgehog in a really kind of affirmative manner, so, I just want to be a hedgehog, hedgehog, snooze away the winter in a nice leafy pile. I just want to be a hedgehog, hedgehog, curl into a ball and escape for a while. But everyone around me is so whizzy, 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 all running round in a tizzy, 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 all out glorifying busy, busy, busy. I don't think so. Well, once I used to dine out fresco, catch a little sun and watch the birdies at their play. Now I've got to eat al desco, cos the boss will say I'm slacking if I spend the time away. Though my mind is going crazy, 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 I can't do me work because I'm hazy, hazy, hazy. If I take a break, you'll say I'm lazy, lazy, lazy. I don't think so. And I just want to be a hedgehog, hedgehog. Snooze away the winter in a nice leafy pile. I just want to be a hedgehog, hedgehog. Curl into a ball and escape for a while. 
But everyone around me is so whizzy, 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 all running round in a tizzy, 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 all out glorifying busy, busy, busy. I don't think so. Cos now you've got to be a striver. I really isn't done to be content or take a rest. Otherwise you are a skyver. And why are you not battling to be up there with the best? I wouldn't even dignify it with the name of rat race. Round in a hamster wheel to end up at the same place. Just die early if you carry on at that pace. And I don't think so. Cause I just want to be a hedgehog. Hedgehog! Snooze away the winter in a nice leafy pile. I just want to be a hedgehog. Hedgehog! Turn into a ball and escape for a while. But everyone around me is so whizzy, whizzy, whizzy. All running round in a tizzy, tizzy, tizzy. All out glorifying busy, busy, busy. I don't think so. So, add some caffeine to your tiredness. Hmm, that'll improve your judgment and make everything just great. Try some coke for added wiredness. Hmm, that'll help you cope with what they're piling on your plate. Headless chickens going manic, manic, manic. All running round in a panic, panic, panic. But if tiredness was a drug, it's so bloody dangerous. They ban it, ban it, ban it. Can you really see that? I don't think so. But I just want to be a hedgehog, hedgehog. Snooze away the winter in a nice leafy pile. I just want to be a hedgehog, hedgehog. Turn into a ball and escape for a while. But everyone around me is so whizzy, whizzy, whizzy. All running round in a tizzy, tizzy, tizzy. All out glorifying busy, busy, busy. I don't think so. Thank you. There you go, Ruth. I haven't stopped it, but um, okay. It, you've got a pretty good. Uh...